But this morning, as seasons and times change, so do playgrounds. Last year, the city of Cedar Falls broke ground on an inclusive playground, but one woman is pushing to build more. KWWL's Elena Kwan is live in Waterloo this morning to tell us more about the Ms. Wheelchair platform. Elena. Good morning. In case you didn't know, one lucky woman is crowned Miss Wheelchair Iowa every year. And this year, the crown went home to Heidi Kreiner. And she was asked to create her own platform after winning the crown and immediately thought of inclusive playgrounds. Living over an hour away from Cedar Falls, she realized there's not another one close by and that Iowa needs to build more specifically in schools. Being a school teacher herself, she has students who also operate in wheelchairs and knows how it feels to be left out on the playground. It feels so good when you're included with everybody else and nobody's like putting you to the side or you're, you're just included with what everybody else is doing and it's fun and it's interacting. So all those things, I mean, it helps with social skills. It helps with physical abilities. Kreiner says with COVID, it has been hard to push her platform, but she says her immediate goals are to try to get the word out to more schools and hopefully set up more meetings and set plans by next year. Live from Waterloo, Elena Kwan, New 7 KWWL. Thanks, Elena. And Craner says uh, she has met with a few schools, but definitely wants to meet with more. And if you'd like to help her, we will have that information for you on our website, kwwl.com.